guys, we're using liquid crafty latex, a liquid latex to do some uh, wound on my face. So what we're doing right now is we're dabbing a very thin layer of latex on the face. It smells like latex. If you've never been to a rubber plantation, it smells like the rubber plantation. But it's absolutely skin safe and we are doing this for Halloween of course. What we're doing is we're dabbing a very thin layer on the face, letting it dry, latex dries with, um, with air. So this product is a proudly made in Malaysia product, Crafty Lay. In a while, we'll show you how to do the peels. So right now, if you look at the latex, it's completely dry on the skin, just a very thin layer and it's transparent. Also, it feels very tight on the skin. So imagine if you want to make, uh, you want to look 20 years older or 50 years older, you put, the, put it on your whole face and it tightens the skin and it wrinkles up and you actually look older. So this is a wonderful product for special effects makeup. So right now, I'm going to get scratched by a safety pin to break the latex layer so that it looks like a road rash or a skin, well, a horrible accident on my face. Now the only thing that hurts about this is when the latex clings onto my face hair. But otherwise, it's good. So right now, if you can see, it's all nicely blistered up. Doesn't hurt at all, but it does feel tight. And Arini here is going to use Ruby Red uh, Special Effects Makeup or Face Painting that is vegan, paraben-free, hypoallergenic, product from USA, and she's going to paint on blisters like how she's doing. She did it on her face. See you in a bit. So this is the end product. If you can see the blisters and the skin that breaks from the liquid latex and the ruby red colouring for bruises and blood. So that's how you do a really simple Halloween makeup, guys. See you guys. Happy Halloween!